It's been a long time since Grand Theft Auto first swerved onto the scene, and yet the acclaimed series has continued to redefine open-world gaming. They might not be games to show off to your nan, but despite, or maybe because, of the rabid controversy that's hounded the franchise, video games have never been the same since. With 2008's Grand Theft Auto 4, the series truly grew up, ditching the colorful zaniness of previous games for a realistic critique of the American dream set within Liberty City, a living, breathing depiction of modern-day New York. With Grand Theft Auto 3 and its two spin-offs, Rockstar gave us rags to riches tales of lowly criminals who've clearly watched Scarface a few too many times. Grand Theft Auto 4 may appear to continue this tradition with lead character Nico Bellic, an Eastern European immigrant, in search of a new life in Liberty City. However, Grand Theft Auto 4's gritty narrative eschews the reliance on cinematic cliches of previous entries to deliver a darker, more realistic storyline with a focus on the ugliness of the criminal lifestyle. Taking cues from complex, sprawling TV dramas like The Wire and The Sopranos, GTA 4 wanted us to become just as immersed in its story as we were in its sandbox of toys. Grand Theft Auto 4 also marked the debut of many new features. Where vehicles once handled with ease, now they had a realistic heft and weight, with car chases often brought to an anticlimactic close by ejecting yourself through a windshield. Combat also changed significantly thanks to the meteoric rise of the cover-based shooter. The cartoonish visuals of previous games found themselves painted over with a layer of HD grime, with Liberty City reborn as a stunning parody of New York City, complete with famous landmarks and thousands of unique pedestrians who go about their daily lives of supping lattes, buying groceries and jogging in the park. Although GTA 4 clearly distinguished itself as a reinvention, the classic structure of the series remained unchanged. As such, you'll complete missions for hoodlums and crime kingpins involving assassinations, drug runs, and yes, trailing cars without being spotted. It's with these familiar tropes that it becomes clear that Rockstar weren't too fussed with reinventing the gameplay itself, but rather planting the series into a more believable and detailed landscape. It's a shame that the flair for innovation didn't spread to the missions, but thankfully there's plenty that rank as some of the best in the series, such as an epic heat-inspired bank heist. With the new Liberty City came new distractions, with Nico free to partake in a game of bowling, go on dates, or if you're feeling particularly meta, spend a few hours playing a video game. In fact, Liberty City is possibly the star of GTA 4, being one of the most believable open worlds ever seen in a video game. Capturing the essence of the Big Apple to a T, Liberty City is crammed with detail. Small touches such as a glowing sunset or the realistic ripple of water all combine to make GTA 4 a stunning game, both then and now. It was also the first game in the series to offer a fully-fledged multiplayer component with a mix of solo and co-op modes which remain popular. Released in a frenzy of hype, it's no surprise that Grand Theft Auto 4 has arguably become the most polarizing entry in the series. For some, the emphasis on realism took the series away from the sordid thrills of early games which reveled in sheer mayhem and sandbox tomfoolery. However, Grand Theft Auto 4's own achievements shouldn't be overlooked, and it deserves to be applauded for its ambition and innovation. The release of two add-on packs only further built on Rockstar's bold new vision for GTA, while their next epic, Red Dead Redemption, successfully expanded on the foundations already laid down by Grand Theft Auto 4. Grand Theft Auto 4 remains one of the most critically acclaimed games of all time, but it also continues to prompt mixed feelings from longtime fans. It's easy to see why Grand Theft Auto 4 divides opinion, but it still deserves to be celebrated and applauded for its attempts to take the series to a new level of gaming artistry. With Grand Theft Auto 5, don't be surprised to find Rockstar redefining the open world game once again. We can't wait.